committed fans and neutrals alike. This is the North London derby when we expect the unexpected. We'll have the action on EA TV. Hello everyone, it's an ideal day for football here in London at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Tottenham Hotspur versus Arsenal. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. The supporters want to see him have a go. And using his strength to shield the ball. Well, just the tackle that was needed. And the starting 11 for Spurs. Timo Werner starts with Dejan Kulusevski out wide. And potentially a handful in attack today. Hyung Min Son. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Declan Rice starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And space available inside. Timely intervention. Bisuma. Madison with it. Saar. Moving the ball nicely, but can they forge ahead? Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Havertz. Plenty of support here. Now disappointing end to the move. Arsenal did well to win back possession. White. On to Jorginho. Moving the ball effectively. Havertz. Still looking for space. Has someone to play it to. It's gone in. Arsenal take the lead in the derby. A real jolt to the home fans. Not what they were expecting. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here, and it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. Well, back underway here. How will Spurs reply to that setback? Romero. Now Romero with it. It's with Porro. Saar. Dejan Kulusevski. Promising move from Tottenham. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Jorginho. Declan Rice. Martinelli. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Saar. A really good pass. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. 
Martinelli. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. Arsenal with the lead going into the second half, but no room for complacency. Bukayo Saka. On to Jorginho. Went in strongly, decisively. And Spurs moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Could be. Oh, body in the way, crucially. Here it is now, a substitution. And there's the delivery. Gabriel Martinelli. Now with Havertz. He's in control of the situation. Jorginho. Oh, how about that for a tackle? Lo Celso. Now Son. Could be a chance to break here. Giovanni Lo Celso. It's a weighted pass. Well, mopping up defensively. Timo Werner. Werner. Now Son. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Martin Odegaard. Werner. Madison. William Saliba. Well, strong play here. Well, they win the throw following that challenge. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Twenty minutes to go. Strong but fair tackle. Kulusevski making progress Bentancur gives it a go palmed away by the keeper Alexander Zinchenko Jorginho it's with Gabriel. Martin Odegaard. Well, you can absolutely sense the frustration growing in the opposition camp. They can't get near the ball. And Kai Havertz. Nicely timed tackle. Well, just listen to these Spurs fans. They're driving their team forward here. Not giving him a moment's peace. Saka. And support available. 
Jorginho. And the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. James Madison. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Werner. Lo Celso. Surely! Oh, what a save to keep them in front! Well, that should have been the equaliser, but it's probably a match-winning save from the keeper. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Delivering it. So the final whistle has sounded and not the result Tottenham fans were hoping for. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent and he fully deserved to score that winning goal.